Hello, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna read to you There is no place like home by Dubrakba Kolanovic. William loved taking long walks with his mom and dad. And every evening, when he when the stars appear in the sky, his mom and dad took turns reading him a bedtime story. One day, mom and dad shared some happy news with William. Before long, a baby brother arrived. William was very excited. But now, mom and dad were busy all the time. And when they forgot his bedtime stories, William was sad. He thought his parents didn't love him anymore. William wanted to find a new home, so he picked up his book and left. William found his friends, the ducklings, waddling through the forest. What's wrong, they asked. I'm looking for a new home, he said. Come with us to our lake, the duckling said. It's very pretty. The lake was pretty, but William was worried about his book getting wet. Next, William met his friend Little Mouse. Come with me to my mouse hole, Little Mouse suggested. It's very cozy. Little Mouse's mouse hole was cozy, but it was far too small for William and his book to fit inside. William then met his friend, Little Wolf. Come with me to my cave, Little Wolf said. It's big enough for both of us. Little Wolf Cave was very roomy, but it was too dark for William to read. The sun was setting and William was still looking for a home. He felt a friendly wing on his shoulder. It was Owl. Come to my nest, Owl said. I love reading. William followed Owl, but when he arrived to Owl's nest, it was too high. William felt lonely. It was dark and he was scared. The stars appear in the night sky. He missed his home and family, but then, but just then he heard some familiar voices. It was mom, dad, and his little brother. William, thank goodness you're safe, said mom and dad. Sorry for leaving, said William. Now I know there is no place like home. Because home is where family is. Even though it was late when they got home, William and his family did not go to sleep right away. After all, mom and dad had to catch up on all the bedtime story he had missed. The end. I hope you guys like it. Please share it with your friends. Give me thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. God bless you.